Guys, after years of trying to get this bloody camera to focus, seriously, autofocus, you know, I've got this setting here, one, two, three, manual focus obviously isn't the right one for autofocus. These other ones, you know, um, I kept on having to either press the screen where I wanted it to focus, right, or halfway press this button down, because you can see it's not focusing. But if I half press that, it'd do it, but sort of, you know, in whatever area I had, I think it's remembered where I clicked last time or something. By the way, this button here brings up, doesn't do anything. It just does what it wants. Get it, get, it, get it out of there. That button there on the left hand side of the camera gives you that menu that you probably keep looking for. It's right there. That's the way to get to it, right there. Okay. And if this, if you push your finger in front of here and this thing just keeps turning off annoyingly, you've got to toggle this three times because one is to make this thing have a sensor and switch between it because when you look through the eyepiece, the screen doesn't want to waste battery and shine in your face at night time. The second one basically turns off this screen and just prioritizes that completely. And the third time prioritizes this and doesn't worry about this eye sensor anymore very good i'm glad i found that out this thing here i guess just set it to facial recognition or just this 49 area you can click that to set it and i'm just going to use that yellow area there and just go set All right anything in the center will be in focus don't know why that's there seriously um here um you'll see as i move around there's writing on that box over there and it's still in no way in focus. If I click it with my knuckle, it focuses, but then I come back here and there's just no focus at all. At the top of the camera, and so basically you go through the menu system and you try to figure out what the bloody hell's going on with all these different settings all over the place. Nothing works, nothing. Okay, you gotta always have to halfway press through there. You can try to set it to AFC, which people keep talking about, right? Just press AFC, oh, it'll work now, right? You know, I set it to that grid, but it doesn't matter. I'm moving and I'm doing all sorts of things. And I'm definitely trying to get that. It's still focusing over there where it was before. It is not auto-focusing. So here's the solution. Here, right? This knob thing here, this windy knob thing, you must, when you first start, go, is that is that thing there where it's pointing? Is it this part over here? But that moves when you turn the camera off and on. Where is it? Where's the arrow that it's pointing to? And it's secretly in under there. You see that little white arrow? Apparently that's where it's set to. And I can tell that because this shows that similar thing. And if I click that, it'll start prioritizing what type of PASM shit that I can't understand, right? And then I discovered this, right? Because I want to put this through OBS, by the way, here's something. Why is that, what I'm seeing here, not appearing in OBS? Well, because I jiggled this, or maybe this became a bit loose, right? Because I'm, I, want to, I want to make a, a vlogging type thing, right? And, and be able to film myself. How do I fix this in relation to this? Do I have to resort cameras, buy a new cable, all sorts of stuff? No, what I do is I press the close button on OBS, then press Windows button, pops that up and then just type O B S and it'll search for it and it'll always ask me for a confirmation for some bloody reason. It wants to make changes to my device apparently. Anyway, here we go. It's loading. Come on, come on OBS. See? Just turn it off and on again. Okay? If that ever becomes unplugged, and by the way, don't be buying long mini or micro HDMI Back to computer. This one is 10 meters long. My computer's in the other room. Okay? Now, here's the solution. Okay? It's still not focusing. still not focusing. And that's showing on the screen, but hopefully that won't be a problem. I can get rid of that. And I'm sure I can just go into the settings and make this display clean. I just reset this camera. That's why that information is showing up in OBS like that. And also, this is a 5K 21 by 9 aspect ratio monitor it's a i've got a made a video about it 
and um, this is only 1080, 16 by 9, okay, what this output is. So I could change my settings in OBS so that it's going to out. I will, but I just had to film a computer game okay, in 5K. So here's how you fix it. The answer. So that arrow is pointed at the camera with an M on it. I thought it might be a dirty sensor and stuff. I took the lens off and looked inside it. It's, it I've always been careful never to let dust get inside that area in there when you unscrew this, right? To remove the lens, you hold that button down, you twist, you need two hands. Um, now I've jiggled that a bit, so I'm always worried that this will become loose and stuff, but have that going out to a female HDMI, and then you can just use any other HDMI, a nice one. This is a fiber optic um, one, which is nice. Um, okay, look, I can focus that by clicking there right now, right? I thought I could. <sighs> okay, it just took a really long time. And I don't know what that, I seriously don't, still don't know what that means. AF off, autofocus off. Why would I want to turn it, autofocus off? Did I just turn it off or did I turn it on? I don't know. Fuck it. Anyway, I'll solve everything right now. And the answer to all our prayers is up here. I can't clean that properly from here anyway. Okay, so here's what I do. See that little IA thing? I auto, I don't know, it's like Apple iPhone, I guess. I have no idea what they mean. I auto, right? That's clicked on. I haven't changed anything else. That's it to AFC, which should have worked before, but it didn't at all, even with all the internal settings and everything. I've been through it a million times, trust me. And look, it auto focused. Come back here. Auto focus. Auto focus. Fridge, autofocus. Yeah, this camera has not autofocused at all. I don't know if I could film in this mode. Let me just double check if I can film. No, it takes no. It takes photos in that mode. But with OBS, I don't think it matters. It doesn't matter, right? Now, now that it's fucking autofocusing for the first time in a thousand years. Fuck, I don't know what that fucking. Means. It's so shit. The interface, really, it's the worst ever. But. Oh, it won't let me. I don't know why that lock button has appeared now. What's this? Don't know what that is. Don't know what... Intelligent Auto Plus, Intelligent Auto with Color Brightness Adjustment. Or Intelligent Auto, all necessary settings are done automatically to obtain good pictures. Yeah, 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 do that one. Of course. Do it forever. But I don't care about pictures. I just care about the output through the HDMI cable. Look, it's focusing. It hasn't focused for years. Boom. Focus ev everywhere. Comes through on OBS and it focuses. Look at that. Autofocus works when it's in that mode. It doesn't work in any other fucking mode. Now that is probably lower than the central thing that I chose earlier. Which I don't know how to get back because usually that was the button to do that. But now that button does nothing. It says lock. I don't know what that means. Do I have to press that button? Now that it goes there. F off. I don't know what's going on. I just wanted that that menu system. But anyway, fuck it. At least it's kind of working, right? And you don't have to be touching the screen there and you don't have to be touching that button there. All you have to do is go into that IA and just remember, where the fuck is this thing, this whole rotary thing facing? No, not that gigantic white thing that you'd think. Of course, it's, that's where it's pointing. That's obvious. It's not. It's wrong. It's that tiny little arrow in, in under the corner there, which is not obvious at all when you're looking at this camera in like a, a normal darkly lit nighttime room, right? But now it's focusing. So that should solve that problem for you. I don't know if... This is slower with IA instead of IA+. plus. Let's go with... Oh, fuck, I don't know what just happened. I have no idea what that red flashing light means. Intelligent auto with color and brightness adjustment. Yeah, do that. Set. So now it's got a little happy flower and shit. Look, it's doing it just by itself. Oh, totally focusing. Oh, 
Look, everything. Absolutely gonna work. I'm gonna mount it up there, put the lighting, and I'm gonna build this giant frame over this beautiful Magnus Pro. I'm gonna set this all back up, and because I won't need to be pressing the record button or using this in video, I'll just disable the on-screen settings here. All right. I'm sure I can go in here and figure this out for you. That's probably the easiest thing compared to all the other shit. Um, on-screen display. Let me see here. Sensor cleaning, I pressed that button, didn't do shit. Um, I reset the phone as well, by the way, everything. Reinserted the time and location. <sighs> TV connection. What happens if I press that? Video app. Pal, 16 by 9. I don't think it matters what the speed is, hopefully. Because it's not it's not causing issues here. The autofocus has stopped working while I'm in this menu, by the way. I don't know why. It's still seeing stuff, but the camera itself isn't seeing stuff, so I guess it doesn't bother to do what it needs to do. Alright, let's just um HDMI info display. Let's see if I press off here. Yep, clean. That's it. TV connection, right? Let's see what else there is here. 3D playback. The hell is that? Okay, so you go into this blue one because I think each one has. No, you press left to get to that side menu. No, they're both blue. Okay, so fuck that one off, fuck that one off, fuck that one off, fuck that one off, and go to that one, two, three, four, fifth one. Then go to page. See, look, there's fucking focus options all over the place. Just ignore all of it. Keep in that menu there. Press to the right once you get there. Then TV connection on page three out of five. Click on that. Go down to info display off. Just to make it fucking complicated, do basic shit. All these buttons all over the place that can be reassigned. So awful. Don't know what don't know what any of this does. Nothing. I don't know if fucking all. I just want the camera to work. I might even change back to my old lens so I can zoom in and out. Because I thought it was the lens's fault. Got all these old. They're not even old. I've hardly ever used this thing because it never focused. Now I've figured it out. All right, I can use this thing now. That'll be good. This one is 14 to 42, I guess, millimeters in terms of whatever the fuck that is. And this one is 24, 25, 25 millimeters. It's two, two and a half centimeters, I guess, from you know, diameter of that front circle. And this one changes. Don't know what that one is. This one says 45 to 150. So the bigger the number, the more telescopic it's going to be. So if I tried to film myself standing or sitting right here in front of this desk from here with this with this lens, it basically zoom into my eye and I wouldn't be able to zoom out any further. So I'm going to use that one, the 14 to 42. That means I can go over there and stand over there and play guitar or whatever and film stuff like that. And obviously film downwards for my puppets and everything. But I'm going to move all that over here when I built the frame over this desk. Thank fuck I figured that out. So just remember, ignore all that shit. Ignore most of the shit, get out of that menu. This is the back button to get out of the menu, by the way. You need basically two hands for everything. Fuck off that menu, if you can close it without pressing, oh, I don't even know what I did, right? Just let it think for itself. AI, or IA, sorry, IA, that's the one you want. You can imagine if you're standing and hardly moving at all, that's going to work perfectly fine on your face. Come on, motherfucker. Okay. Yeah, so imagine that positioned on a tripod right there over the top of your monitor. 
It's perfect, okay? Good.